क्वेश्चन वन फाइंड द स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग नंबर्स बाय डिवीजन मेथड 1024 सॉल्यूशन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ 1024 स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द यूनिट्स प्लेस लेट अस टेक टू डिजिट्स टुगेदर एंड पुट देम अंडर बार्स देयरफॉर 10 कम्स अंडर वन बार एंड 24 कम्स अंडर अनदर बार नाउ Let us find the largest number whose square is less than or equal to the number under the extreme left bar. In this case, we have ten. Three square, which means nine, is less than ten, and four square, which means sixteen, is greater than ten. Therefore, in this case, we will take three. Now, take this number three. as the divisor and the quotient and let us divide 10 with 3 so we get 9 and 10 minus 1 we are left with 1 so the remainder is 1 let us carry forward the other number under the bar which is 24 so now the new term is 124 now double the divisor and enter it with the blank on its right side guess a largest possible digit to fill the blank which also becomes the new digit in the quotient such that when the new number is multiplied to the new quotient the product is less than or equal to the new dividend in this case we can see that 62 into 2 is equal to 124 so the new digit in the quotient is 2 and by this we get a remainder 0 since the remainder is 0 therefore square root of 1024 is equal to 32 solution square root of 900 now starting from the units place Let us take two digits together. In this case, it becomes zero zero and nine. Now, let us find the largest number whose square is less than or equal to the number under the extreme left bar. In this case, we have nine. Three into three is equal to nine. So, we will take three as our divisor. and the quotient will also become 3 therefore 9 minus 9 is equal to 0 so our remainder is 0 now let us carry forward the remaining term under the bar which is 00 zero, zero. our new dividend is 0 0 now double the divisor and enter it with a blank on its right now you have to guess a largest possible digit to fill the blank which also becomes the new digit in the quotient such that when the new number is multiplied to the new quotient the product is less than or equal to dividend in this case we can see that 60 into 0 is equal to 0 0 0 so the new digit in the quotient is 0 and obviously you get your remainder 0 since the remainder is 0 therefore square root of 900 is equal to 30